Hi guys, and welcome back to the Little Shop of Laura. So I made this a uh, winning veil. And so this is the banquet flower. And this is butterfly on a dress. So this is the regular abetila. And this is the wedding betila. So I made this close her eyes and her eyelashes on it. And, and so we're going to finish this uh, project a tutorial. So let's get started. Now let's continue working on this tutorial. And now let's start make head. Round 40, increase 12 single crochet. And then I'm going to take the mark. So this is important for us. And then I'm going to continue increase. And we'll continue working on this round. Round 41, one single crochet and one increase. I already got one single crochet and now I can take the this mark. And now one increase. I'll show you one more time. One single crochet and one increase. We're going to continue working on this round. We'll be right back. And round 42, only one increase each side. One. Well, we will take that mark. I already have one single crochet. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and one increase. And now we're going to be next to single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, and 14. And now one increase. And now round 43 to 49, single crochet and 34 points. And we will take this mark. We're going to continue working on this round. Keep going until the end of this round. 34 points. Round 50. One decrease on each side. 32 points. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, and 13, 14, 15, and now one degrees. One single crochet. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And now one degrees. Last mention of one, two, and three. Okay, so round fifty one, single crochet and thirty two points. One single crochet and then mark it on, all taken. Two, three. We will continue working on this round. Keep going until the end of this round. 32 points. And now round 52. Two single crochet and one decrease. One. And two. And now one decrease. One more. One. Two. And one decrease. We're gonna continue working on this round. Round 53, one single crochet and one decrease. And I'm gonna take mark. I already got uh, one single crochet. And now, and then, one decrease. One single crochet and one decrease. We'll continue working on this round. Keep going until the end of this round. And now I put the stuff inside. We need a lots of stuff. Let's put right here. Just like that and then we a lot of stuff inside. All right, and then, and, and there is some more, and there you go, and a little bit more, and there you go. Now, let's continue. Round 54, degrees, 24 points. And then we will take the mark. So 24 points is going to be in, into the 12 points. And two, three, and four. Well, we'll continue working on this round. Keep going until the end of this round. Round 55, single crochet and 12 points. One, two, three. We will continue working on this round. We're almost done. Keep going till the end of this round. And now a slip a stitch. One chain. And then leave a long tail on. Now I can cut the yarn. Leave the long tail. And now I can close. We don't need this mark anymore. So I'm gonna use the needle. And sew it around.
And now I can cut it off. And we're finished at her head. And so, look how cute it is. All right. And now let's move on to the making the hair. Let's get started. Six matching green and single crochet. Round two, single crochet and increase six to twelve. Round three, one single crochet and one increase. Round four, two single crochet and one increase. And then round five, three single crochet and one increase. And then round six, Four single crochet and one increase. And then round seven, five single crochet and one increase. So that's a total of 36 points and that's it. So now I'm going to um, 35 or 36 chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. All right, so I don't have much as I have a long hair. Betila is a really long hair. Now, we're gonna start working on this point. So one single crochet and first in the back loop. And then have double crochet. We will continue working on this round. Let's keep going until the end of the um, of this round. Right in the bottom of the hair. We'll be right back. Now half double crochet in the bottom. Just for the word on the, the back of the um, stitches. And then one single crochet. And now we work on a slip stitch. One, two, three, and four. And now I need 11 more hair pieces. So I'm going to continue working on this round. I need 11 more hair. So we're gonna have a lot of work to do for making it hair. So we'll be right back for a minute. And now I have 10 hair pieces. I'm gonna show you what's this look like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm here in the seven points. And now chain 10 to make long hair bang. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And now, single crochet and then double crochet, okay? One single crochet and then double crochet. I heard that my brother is, is such a crazy, <laughs> he, he's really funny guy. Sorry about that. Well, I really love that hair, so. I'm very excited to to work on this hair. So anyway, we're going to continue our working on this round. We'll be right back. Just let us know about it, okay? Keep going. Until in the way bottom of the hair. And this is where I'm going to do. And now, half double crochet. And then one single crochet. 
And now let's work on a slip stitch. One slip stitch, two slip stitch, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, and 16, and 17. And there you go. I'm going to leave a long tail. Oh, now I, I already cut it. So I need two more hair pieces right next to the um, hair bangs. So. This just needs to be uh, go on the left sided that way for the hair bank. So this is the result of hair. And now I put the pin around the hair and I'm going to start the sew around the hair. So I already put this uh, um, pin on the hair bank. So, so that's the way I'm going to do. Now I have two more hair parts that have 35 chains with the double crochet and then one more hair i already made just like that i have total of 13 hair pieces so one short hair with a hair bang and 12 long hair now i'm going to sew it work on that so we're gonna do from now on I'm gonna have a lot of hair working to do, and we will be right back for a minute. Keep going of this hair. We'll be right back. And now I already had the sew on the hair. And then let's work on this um, hair. Right, um, this sew on the forehead. Let's do the sewing. And there you go. And I'm connecting on that. Make sure I need to stay still with that pin. And there you go. I'm going to keep working on that sewing the hair. As you can see. I already finished this um, hair bang. And now let's work on this uh, hair around. So I can uh, work on that. And first things first. We're gonna do working on that, the other hair side. On the sew that, okay? Now tighten this up. Just make sure you have to put the knot very tightly. And now we can cut it off. And now push inside the crochet with the stuff inside in the head. And now let's finish the hair back on it. So I already put the pin on it. So we're gonna keep working on that. We'll be right back. And now I already had our uh, other side of this hair. I just already did uh, sewing it. If I sew this uh, pieces uh, together, I take out the pin on the hair on head top. So it's it's easy to, to hold still on it. It's better way to do it. And now I'm going to make sure I'm going to sew it on the head back head the back of the head with the hair so i need to 
to sew in together the hair just like that. I am continuing this working on the hair. So keep sewing it. I don't need the pin anymore if if I have a hold the hair because uh, we it doesn't um, come out like that. Well, sewing is is always holding still with this hair because it's a very good idea to to use a pin holding the hair and then put the pin on our head top. Let's keep going until you finish the hair. And this is result of this hair. Isn't she cute and very beautiful? I really love it. All right, so let's move on to the her face, like the eyes, nose, and mouth. And now I'm making eyes. I am making the eyes close with the black yarn. The eyes were just between round 46 and 50. So I already put the pin on it. Just write that between it. I'm gonna use the uh, black yarn. So black yarn is, is just using the kind of like uh, eyeshadow sometimes, but more like um, eyelashes. They're not eyebrows, but that's eyelashes. It's mostly the uh, black eyelashes. This will be very pretty. Now let's keep working until we finish the, um, the eyes. And now I'm going to use the eyelashes. Just hold on to that. Just go in the, through with the sewing and stop. And then tie this up tightly. And then it cut in the half. Just like that. And then make it divided into the very thin yarn. And we can cut it short. And I finished eyes close with the eyelashes. I love it. It's so cute. And now let's move on to the nose right now. And now I'm making nose. This nose were in round 44 and 45. That's where um, I'm doing the, this making this nose just between round 44 and 45. Just have to do working on this just a couple of times. Sew it around the nose. And now I can cut it off. And that's it. Really cute noses. <laughs> and now I'm making.
Mickey Mouse to make a smile. This mouth were between round 42 and 43. I'm just using the black threads with a mouth on it. Just want to make sure that um, I'm just twice of the so embroidering the mouth. And cut it up for a little bit for short, and then I will keep working on that. And now I can cut it off. And there you go. Smile is finished. I really love that smile. All right, let's finish the, um, this. Put the clothes on. First, I'm gonna put on the dress. So by the way, guys, I already put the butterfly on the dress on the right side. It's very pretty. Not can back on the dress. I'm gonna close it with a button on. This fits looks perfect. And then And then so buckwet flower. I really don't like to tell you, um, my big needle is broken. So now I already got uh, so the buckwet flowers. And then and now put the shoes on. That's a beautiful combination with the purple hard jewelries on. And put some on on the strapped shoes. I feel kind of a bit sad that the big needle is broken, so it's it's really hard for me working on a banquet flower. So don't worry about that. I already got the new um, needle, which is the metal. So it's better to use the, the metal materials, um, tools. So, and then the, the veil, wedding, and hat. I'm gonna put this hat on. Just make sure that the, on the hair back is on very low and the forehead high up. So this is just like that. I love that hair. Now we can sew the the hat, which is uh, connecting on the hair. Just only the hair, not the forehead. Okay, let's do it. Now sew the hat over the work on her hair. I already put some pin because um this I'm sewing it right this way and tightly so I, i'm gonna close the loose hat into the perfect fit hat now let's work on the sewing on her hair just right where we place it over here but not the skin forehead okay Original Betila, I sewed the, um, the hair bang, so I, I like the a better idea I can make, just in case so you made a better idea. If you don't want to, that's fine. And now let's go, go through all the way right to the right side.
And now um, sewing the other side with the hair. Sewing the hat. Also, we're gonna do the same thing for the working on the sewing. Remember, sew the tightly loose hat, close the loose hat into the perfect fit, okay? And then we'll continue to do the um, sew it around hat. We're almost done. We don't need this pin anymore because I already closed the loose hat into the perfect fit hat. So now let's continue uh, sew it around in the back. Let's finish. go through it up and now I can cut that off and we don't need to spend anymore and look at that <laughs> I love it <laughs> and so the next step we're gonna do is say the makeup and now I can put some lipstick on and you can put some blush on. Now we can go ahead and put some lipstick first. And put some lipstick. Mm-hmm. And there's some lipstick. And then we're going to put some blush on. And some pink in here. And then a little bit of the, this Zaha pink on the other side. And we're done for this makeup. Now I'm going to put some jewelries on, which is the, the blue pearls from Rayman original 1995 video game. And now I can put the jewelry on her neck. And then put some jewelries and tight this all really tightly. And then we go ahead and And one more. And that's it. I got it up and that's it. So, I got the blue necklace right now. And thank you so much for watching. For this video that's a wedding, for crocheting. Make sure to subscribe and comments and likes. And I'll see you later. Bye.